the ATB5 has successfully completed the European part of its integration and testing activities and is now being prepared for shipment by boat to the European spaceport in French Guiana, Kourou, where it will start the final part of its preparation for launch by undergoing another series of tests and assembly and filling activities that will keep the teams of European industry and European Space Agency itself busy until mid of next year, 2014, before the ATV-5 is declared ready for launch on the top of an Ariane 5 vehicle, where it will start its five days journey to the International Space Station. After completion of the integration of the Ariane 5 uh, uh, rocket, the ATV-5 will be hoisted through the chimney of the final assembly building and put on the top of the rocket by means of this black huge cylinder behind me which represents the so-called separation and distancing module which is in practice the piece representing the interface between the rocket and the ATV itself. And here we can see the two main halves which the ATV, each ATV is composed of. Right on my right side, we see what we call the spacecraft, which is the lowest part when it is mounted on the top of the launcher. And it is composed of the cylindrical lower part, which is the equipped propulsion bay containing the tanks and the main engines for the ATV own propulsion. And uh, in the upper part, this pseudo-conical <coughs> ring, which contains all the avionics of the ATV, therefore really the brain of the spacecraft with the power subsystem, the communication subsystem, the computers, and a lot of other things which will allow the ATV to fulfill its mission to the ISS. And here we can see the useful half of the ATV, the so-called integrated cargo carrier, which will host all the cargo, dry and liquid cargo, that the ATV will transport to the International Space Station. Up to six and a half, 6.6 .6 tons of cargo will be delivered to the ISS, and through the hatch that the crew will open after successful docking of the ATV to the ISS, the crew will be able to transit from the ISS to the ATV in order to perform their cargo delivery and trash loading operations at the end of the mission.